Memphis. Sneakers. Stolen? Everyone knows there's a Nike facility in Memphis. I mean, most of the boxes that you get in the mail from Nike are addressed from Memphis. High visibility, a perimeter fence, but no cameras in the back by the loading docks. Trailers got absolutely raided. Nike, Jordan brand, they always have new releases coming out. A group of now highly sought after individuals took advantage. They breached the perimeter fence, ransacked the trailers, and stole over $800,000 worth of sneakers. There were tons of new releases on those trailers. The Cherry 11s, which should be the Holiday 11 release this year. The Metallic 6s, which haven't dropped yet. The Navy 4s, haven't dropped yet. And then a few other styles of 4s, Dunks. And boy, did they leave a mess. A lot of these photos surface, whether that be on the news or social media. People dumb enough to flex having cases of these shoes after they just stole them. Or is that what they want you to think? Is the flex really worth facing the crime of an $800,000 heist? These shoes are the last thing that I would be flexing at a time like this. And in the one photo, the Cherry 11s, you can see the dude wearing fake Yeezys at the top. The other flex photo, the guy can be easily identified because he's holding the shoe with his tattoo in the picture. Tattoos are used all the time to help identify suspects. We either have some really, really dumb sneaker burglars or these photos were posted just for hype. Nice Kicks even stated that StockX halted sales of some of these colorways in hopes to find and identify suspects that were involved with this case. It sounds to me like a multi-billion dollar company like Nike should probably secure their boundaries a little bit better. Oh, and I don't know, maybe some cameras all the way around the property? Kind of strange these thefts haven't been taken care of yet. It seems like they've been happening way too often. Nonetheless, it stirred up some buzz in the sneaker community, and that's why I'm here to share it. If you have any questions or comments about the $800,000 heist, drop those in the comments below or hit me up on IG. The handle is the same, at Sneakers. Of course, if you made the trip to Memphis and you've got some shoes on deck that you'd like to sell me, hit me up. Kidding, kidding. As always, thank you guys for watching and do not forget, this is all about sneakers.